You know, we're looking at very good competition. Um, you know, I would say Visitation is the favorite. They're a very tough team, but when you look at the teams that are all there, um, it's, I want to say, four private schools, and then um, quite a few of the other schools are pretty, pretty good-sized schools. You know, you got your Hutchinsons or Monticello's, um, those type of schools, um, Mankato West, where their schools significantly bigger than us. They're very good competition. Um, you look at, you know, where they're at. There, a lot of the programs there are programs that have been um, very strong programs for a long time, consistently strong programs. Um, and, and we have too. I mean, we've been there. This is our sixth time down at the state true team meet in a row. And so um, we've competed with these teams before and know that we can we can hang there with them. And so um, what we're going to have to do in order to you know be successful at this meet is really see good consistency from everybody. Um, every swim really counts, you know, from your first swimmer to your fourth swimmer. And so we're going to be looking for just consistency. We had a very consistent section meet, uh, section true team meet. And so we're looking at doing the same thing down at the state meet. Just everybody chipping in, doing their part. Uh, relays are really important. Um, our A and B relays, but also the C and D relays take extra importance at the true team meet because uh, that's one area where I think we can uh, finish ahead of a lot of schools is with having faster C and D relays than them and, and racking up some points that way. Um, and then some other big things, you know, we're just looking at, uh, it's a good experience to swim down at the U pool for everybody. Um, it's really the only way that the whole team gets to go down to the U of M pool and swim at a, at a state meet. And so, you know, for the girls to be bringing, you know, a good amount of intensity, good amount of focus, and uh, really putting everything out there on, on all of their swims. Can you highlight some of the girls that uh, the seasons that they've had to get to this point, they've obviously done very well. Who are some of those girls? Yes, um, we'll start with uh, Sydney Rasmussen. She's a senior for us. Uh, she swims the IM and the breaststroke and uh, has been only really about a second and a half off of her school record in the IM this year and uh, also has been, uh, has gone uh, under state cuts in the breaststroke as well. And so um, looking at where she's at, you know, she's had a great season for us. Um, and then she's joined in those two events by Joanne Kolbach as well. Um, Joanne's an exchange student from Denmark and she's been, uh, she was actually the true team section champ in both the IM and the breaststroke uh, and has gone under cuts in the breaststroke and been uh, very fast in the IM as well. And so those two really give us a nice one-two punch in those events. Uh, on Saturday, they both have a good chance to be in the top eight in both of those events, which is quite impressive. And then uh, Gabby Sawyer has been a really strong flyer and backstroker for us. Um, she's, she's been very fast in the butterfly all year under uh, state cuts in that several times and uh, has set some records, pool records and those sorts of things in the, in the butterfly. So we're looking for a good butterfly finish from her, but she's also come on strong in the backstroke and uh, really has had some good drops in that backstroke. She's going lifetime best in that and uh, has a good chance to uh, make it a state in that event as well. Um, and she's joined by Michaela Van Waldy, who's actually an eighth grader, who's uh, had some really good times in the backstroke also. Um, so we have a good, really, backstroke's one of our strongest events, uh, one through four, and so looking forward to that on Saturday. And then uh, Rachel Kalzer's really been a strong swimmer for us this year as well. Um, she set our pool record in the 200 freestyle. Uh, she's also been swimming. She could swim both the 500 free and the 100 free. We're kind of focusing more on the 100 free with her, but um, she's been a really strong freestyler for us. Um, and then, you know, like our, uh, our other seniors, Caitlin Ketter um, has really provided some, some good swims in the sprint events. Brittany Buddy um, swims IM and fly for us and provides us some good depth there um, as well. And then uh, in diving, We've been doing well also. Jewel Buddy's really stepped up as um, our top diver as well, and we have good depth in diving too. So really looking across the board, we're, we're pretty strong um, in every event, and so we're looking forward to having a really, really strong true team meet.